Hi guys, welcome back to my War of the Vision video. Like usual, I'm gonna give you news for this week. Okay, so we get two new characters. Okay, Keaton and Whisper. Both of them are UR rarity. Okay, so there is no MR characters on this week. So the main question should you pull on this banner? First of all, if you have pull the Final Fantasy tactic characters then it is obvious simply no because you still need Fissiors to raise your Final Fantasy tactic characters. It is only one week left so spend your Fissiors to buy their shards okay. Now what if you don't pull Final Fantasy tactic characters? Maybe I can say still no okay. Let's take a look on Keton first. So Keton, okay, really nice unit. I really like Ninja. Okay, she's the only UR art slasher at this point, and some of player kind of had Eileen. So yes, I must say Keton can become good if you like art elemental attackers. And remember that being art element means that she is quite strong against Orlando because Earth wins again Thunder on this game. However, Keton main selling point is her evasion. This is the problem, okay? To make sure she has high evasion, at least you need Sifa Vision card because like you know that Sifa Vision card grants evasion to all characters and that's pretty good. And the problem is Sifa card is an UR fishing card. So yes, it is hard to obtain and to max the level. Okay, f especially for free to play players. You also need to have equipment which increase efficient. One of equipment that able to do that is her own trust mastery word. So I think that make her not that good for free to play or even dolphin players because for free to play and dolphin it probably takes you long time to max these characters. Okay? And for a job I like I said I really like Keton here her job is ninja so it is obvious that she is fast and mobile on the battlefield. And yeah, the good thing as a ninja is she has access to three hits attack. So like you can see here, dream within a dream. Deal three high three hits damage minimum to target with high chance of critical. So yes, maybe it is not medium damage like uh Ramza, okay, but I must say it's pretty decent, okay. And the limit burst deal two hits damage to target and chance on inflicting stop. It's also very good in my opinion. Okay, inflicting stop. If the character stop, then they are as good as dead. Okay. So yes, the main conclusion for Keton is yes, I can say that she is high maintenance girl. Okay. Next character, Whisper. So this Whisper. Mm, it is a dark elemental UR character, okay? Her main job is Nike, so it is obvious she can become a breaker. And yes, I must say she is a good breaker because she has Trinity, Trinity Break. So Trinity Break is amazing, okay? It, like you can see here, it deals medium damage to target and lower attack, magic, and agility. So yes, it is really useful. And her second job, Samurai. Samurai is really good job, but the bad news for uh, Whisper is her Samurai job doesn't have Congo. So yes, maybe Samurai is not a best subclass for her, okay, but that will be more talk on her review video. And the third job, it is Spellblade. It is the same job like Ramza. And Yes, after taking a look on her stats, I must say that her magic stats is kind of low unlike Ramza, so maybe she is not that good as Spellblade damage dealer like Ramza. Okay, the main selling point I guess is her unique trait. What is that? She has 25% on all attack type resist. So yes, that's amazing. 
because yes, usually even as a tanker, okay, Engelbert is really amazing tanker, but he still takes 30% magic damage. But for this Whisper, oh, she has 25% for all elemental resist, not all elemental, all attack type resist, and if I'm not mistaken, from her master ability, she gets additional 5%. So yes, 30% on all attack type resist. How's that, that amazing? That means she can become a good magic tank because on spellblade job, there is a skill called taunting spell. So that will increase your hit or aggro level. So the enemy gonna attack you. Okay, so I say magic tank because as a physical tank i think angel bird is still better than her because angel bird of course he has better health etc but yeah let's talk about that uh later on her review video but the point here is this okay until now i don't find any content on this game where i need magic tank okay so my angel bird still can tank pretty good okay so that's why I think she is kind of niche and she twitch situational character. Okay, so maybe I don't need her at this point. Okay, so that's the reason I don't think you need to pull her too. Okay, same for Kiton, simply niche and well characters. Okay, but it is all up to you. I have talked about what they can do and, and cannot do. Okay. And yes, let's. That's all for the characters. Now let's talk about the special thing which come on this week. Okay, so yes, this game has been downloaded by four million. Okay, so we wow, pretty big, because if I remember correctly, this game just out for maybe about one and half month and four millions whoa that's a lot you may say there are many players who reload the game yes that's correct but still four millions are huge okay and they give us this you are unit guaranteed 10 times summon so the first thing i hope is this can be done using free vcrs okay but yeah, if this cannot be done with free VCRs, then it's kind of stupid because it is 4 million downloads, okay? It is not like Final Fantasy Tactics Celebration. Yes, I understand for that banner if you want to use paid VCRs, but for this one, I think it should be free VCRs, okay? But yeah, the point here is this. If you get Keton and Whisper, and yes, I believe there's a chance for that because you can see there they are they appear on this picture. Okay, so I believe this banner also include them, but probably not gonna get the boost. Okay, and if you get one of them, you can buy the shards on the wait wait on the this one new unit shop i believe like it will be like usual you can use 6000 fish yards to buy 120 shards and yes if you manage to get kiton or whisper it's a good idea to buy those shards okay if you plan to race them if you don't plan to race them simply ignore it okay for me i don't think i'm gonna race whisper but if i get kiton maybe i will race her because i still have lots of art awakening materials okay because i don't raise my mon because i have angel bird as a tanker so i don't need mon as a tank okay for whisper she is good as a magic tank like i said but i have too many dark elemental attackers that's why probably i won't have any resources to raise her okay that's why i don't i won't buy her shots so the point here is do depends on your situation okay of course like i said in the beginning if you still if you have final fantasy tactic characters ramza or landu then simply ignore these two characters okay even if you get them make sure you buy every shards ramza and orlando when they appear okay really if you have put final fantasy tactic manner stick it to the end make them into limit break four or limit break five 
Limit break 4 is the least limit break you should try to get. Okay? And that's all for the new characters and info. And let's talk about this celeb another celebration, okay? So first, we're gonna get 4 million download login bonus. So it is also nice. We get a total of 2,500 VCRs. So yes, that's huge. And we can do one... 10 times pull using this okay so yes if you want to try your luck on ketone or whisper you can do that okay basically yeah you are guaranteed is free if you can do that by using vcr so good thing and we also get this item drop double up campaign so i must say this is quite nice because like you can see it lasts until 19 may 2020 so yes you don't need to farm on these stages at this point because yes they last for this event lasts for two weeks so at this week still focus on final fantasy tactic event but the problem is on the next event okay story quest jp and item drop double up campaign so this one oh this one i think this one should be two weeks too but instead this only lasts for one week so you may have a problem choosing which to farm okay final fantasy tactic or this jp and item drop double up campaign so yeah i usually farm on the story quest when i need to gather that uh job and feign memory okay because they are more yeah, energy is friendly, okay, because the high training chamber need 24 energies, okay, and the drop rate range are simply too huge, okay? You can get too many random items on that training chamber, but yeah, this make me confused, okay, why they don't make this into two weeks. So this kind of psych suck, but yeah, it is still good. Maybe only farm this when you need to level up your job level, okay? Necessarily not to hoard some materials, okay? Only farm when necessary. And we also get guild gift campaign, so very nice, okay? Because using this guild coin, you can buy rainbow fragment of Todd, okay? Really rare materials. And for this arena campaign, I'm not, I'm not a big fan of arena and it's shop so yeah nice definitely but not my two cent okay so that's all guys about this week event okay so yeah there are no new events simply new characters so what i can recommend to you is simply focus on final fantasy tactic banner especially get that neck narrow okay so neck narrow is really good sword because i have take a look on the materials and wow that sword is really easy to craft okay i will talk about nagnarok on other video but yeah that's it for today thank you very much for watching please hit the like button and subscribe to my channel for more war of the fission video bye bye guys